Hello, my name is Dolores Lamonico. I'm a registered nurse and a certified geriatric care manager. I am a member of the National Association of Professional Geriatric Care Managers and the Florida Geriatric Care Managers Association. I've lived and worked on the Treasure Coast for almost 19 years in the field of geriatric health and wellness in several hospitals as well as skilled nursing facilities. I have also been an Alzheimer's nurse consultant and cared for the developmentally disabled and those with physical disabilities. For the past 11 years, I've been with First Step RN Care Management a privately owned full service health care provider that's been in business for over 18 years. First Stats comprehensive RN care management program is one of the largest in Florida. We cover all of the Treasure Coast as well as Palm Beach, Broward, and Miami-Dade counties. I'll speak a little more about First Stat later in our discussion. But first let's address the question, what is a care manager? A care manager is a care advisor a health and human services specialist who acts as a guide and an advocate for families caring for older adults or individuals of any age with a disability or the need for life care management. Ideally, a care manager is trained and licensed in a field such as nursing or social work. Some persons may call themselves a care manager without these qualifications, so it's important to know the background and the experience of the person you are considering hiring to care for the needs of your loved one. More about that a bit later. But when should you seek the services of a care manager? You may want to consider engaging, engaging a care manager if you are facing any of the following life situations. Caregiving has become overwhelming. This can happen to an older couple when one per partner is failing or becoming dependent on the other. When the individual needing care has limited family support, in our community, many older adults have children that live out of state and are not able to visit frequently. When the individual has multiple or complex medical or psychological issues. When the individual needing care is unable to live safely in their environment and may need transition to a higher level of care, but you're not sure what level of care is needed or which facility would best meet their needs. When you notice changes in your loved one's personality, behavior, or ability to care for themselves, neglecting their grooming, or forgetting to take medications, trouble navigating the healthcare system, not understanding or not remembering what their doctor has told them. You may have also concerns about their ability to drive safely or manage their finances. So what questions should you ask when looking for a care manager? Some questions are, what are the care manager's professional credentials? Is he or she licensed and insured? As I mentioned earlier, someone can call themselves a care manager, but may not have the education or experience to competently manage your loved one's care. They also may not have adequate insurance coverage, which can pre present a liability to the client. Is the care manager a sole practitioner or are they a member of a professional team or agency that provides support and backup to ensure that there is always someone available in an emergency? Is the care manager a member of a national association that ensures accountability as well as guidelines for practice and a requirement for continuing education? How long has he or she been providing care management services? When it comes to caring for older adults or persons with disabilities or complex medical needs, experience counts. Is the care manager available for emergencies and after hours where problems can occur on weekends or holidays? Like my client who broke her hip on the 4th of July. What are the benefits of using a certified geriatric care manager? A certified geriatric care manager is able to provide a personalized plan of care tailored to the individual's needs and wants and is typically available 24-7. A certified geriatric care manager supports their client's independence and may help delay the higher cost of care by providing necessary support and ongoing monitoring. We also recognize that most people's wish is to remain in their own home for as long as possible. I met a lady with, with advanced Parkinson's disease whose husband had died and she was now in a nursing home. Her wish was to return to her own home despite the obstacles. We were able to put a plan in place 
and with the proper equipment, caregiver, and monitoring. This lady enjoyed doing it her way until she passed away five years later. A certified geriatric care manager helps ensure continuity of care for the client by facilitating communication between family, doctors, and other professionals. Using a certified geriatric care manager helps ensure quality control. The service must follow the National Association Standards of Practice and Code of Ethics. Licensed individuals such as registered nurses and social workers are also responsible to their individual boards in the states in which they are licensed. So why choose First Stat RN Care Management? At First Stat, all of our care managers are registered nurses. We are all certified geriatric care managers or case managers, and we are all members of the national and Florida chapters of geriatric care manager associations. At First Stat, we have a team approach, including peer review and oversight. Our assessments and recommendations are individualized to meet the needs of your loved one. First Stat has been in business since 1995 and is licensed, bonded, and insured. There is always a care manager available to address your concerns and to handle emergencies. From pediatrics to geriatrics, including intergenerational goals for elders who are caring for their special needs children, we go above and beyond to exceed your expectations with excellent communication and collaboration with our clients and their families.